Hello guys, welcome to another video of Carolina EDC Reviews. I want to bring some new products, uh, well not new, but new to me, from the guys at Ford's manufacturer that was kind enough to send two of their products here for me to test out and upgrade on the uh, Fox Drop mic here. Uh, you know, review that I've done this. Uh, this one came with a standard uh, 2A birdcage type. And I wanted to get something more, uh, you know, to shoot a little bit flat flatter, uh, being as a 5.56, don't kick much, but you know, Anything helps to keep that recoil and muscle down, for fast follow-up and everything. So I haven't shot any rounds in it, so this could be my first impression and see how well it control the rifle. But also, they send a foregrip here, which also interested to check out as well. And you can get this in different colors. Uh, but the break is going to be the uh, red uh, muscle device in 5.56. And as you can see, it has three holes on the top. And then you got your big ports on the side. You have three big wide ports here. So that's definitely going to control the muscle and get your follow uh, shots real, real fast, which uh, I really like. So a little bit expects here. I'm reading from my phone here. So it's 41, 41, uh, 40 uh, steel, not tried, coated, which again, this is the 556 version. Uh, it is half by 28. Uh, threads comes with a crush washer. It only weighs 2.4 ounces and the length of this is 2.194 inches And again, it just looks very nice. You can get this and more so like a stainless steel too as well uh, If I'm not mistaken, let me look back again and also they have this and um, Like I said stainless type look stainless steel look but anyway, it looks good. I like it so far so good uh, looks good but as far as the uh, angle grip this is going to be the the shift short angle grip for the picatinny they do have for the m-lock as well uh, i mean uh picatinny uh no i'm sorry m-lock and uh, the other one i can't remember what's <laughs> what it is but anyways uh this runs around 70 bucks it's a one-piece billet design it's got a uh, slotted screw attachment, aircraft grade 661 aluminum, military specification type 3 hard, hard code analyzed, only weighs 2 point ounces, and also made in America. All right, so definitely like the look of it. Definitely be an addition to this rifle for a, you know, hand stop or, or angle grip. And it seems to feel nice and ergonomic. Be able to push that rifle to your shoulder. Kind of has a slant look i don't know if you can see that right there and it has two screw guns with allen wrench and you can definitely mount it on here nice and, and easy uh, but other than that let's go ahead rip some rounds through this see how well it, it does as far as shooting flat really really interested it does have a uh, hole right here if you want to pin and weld it so that's good uh so if you have a short barrel and want to bring it to the six and inch length you can also weld and weld it as well all right enough talking let's take some shots and see how well it shoots all right stand by all right guys so we have some uh phoenix ammunition frangible ammo uh and we use some new mags from uh a2 i meant to max and this is their new magazines they came out with the uh new version of mod 3 if that's what they call it it looked a little bit different they have like uh different colors uh followers and everything and um yeah, first time using it, so appreciate the guys for sending Max, and let's see how well it runs with this uh, five drop mic AR. All right, like I say, I haven't shot any rounds with this, so uh, let's see how well it shoots flat. First impressions, okay. Uh, I could definitely feel the blast a little bit while I'm shooting, but as you see, I stopped on the first round. I didn't think it ejected the uh, the casing. <laughs> it kind of threw me off there for a minute. Uh, wow, that's how flat it's shooting. Man, that's that's crazy. All right, let's continue. Holy moly! <laughs> Woo. Uh, yeah. Then I got a few rounds here. The uh, A2, I'm in two bags, are working fine. All right, let's continue. Oh, we out. Oh, we out. Then lock back. 
Whew, okay. All right, so the muscle break definitely, definitely can shoot fly. You can, it would, you can even feel the rifle rising. I kind of anticipate a little bit leaning forward, but you don't have to with this break here. I'm very amazed so far. Uh, we have another Mac here. And again, and I meant two Max. <laughs> Check this out. Very cool translucent Max here. You can get different ones. Uh, I think they're very limited on this, uh, but it's got sprinkle translucent. And we are still running frangible ammo. We'll run standard 223 ammo here in a second. But uh, yeah, as far as the vertical grip, uh, the full grip, I'm sorry. The angle grip. I don't know. I mean, kind of get used to it. It's a little bit. This angle here kind of gets me. I wish it was more slanted than, uh, but that's the whole point of it to be able to keep control of the rifle and push it toward your shoulder. I mean, I think that what, what gets me is this, this angle right here. I wish it was a little bit more straighter. And definitely will feel more ergonomic for myself. I mean, that's just me. It could be a little bit different for other people. But uh, as far as the muscle break, wow. Let's see uh, how fast I can shoot it. Woo! Wow. Uh, I have to say it's doing the job. And again, they kind of came up with this muscle break for comp competition type. Uh, but man, that thing is ridiculous. Uh, definitely, definitely will. If I feel another AR or maybe switch one of my ARs, that definitely be the one break I definitely, uh, choose. Definitely if you build in a short barrel, that definitely will keep it flat for sure. But, uh, yeah. Wow. I'm impressed. The red uh, muscle device here from Fortis Manufacturing. I, I, I'm amazed. Definitely amazed. Like I said, it definitely keeps it flat. All right, let's shoot some more. Give it a different angle so you can see how flat it shoots. Stand by. All right, guys. So I just got standard 223 ammunition again. Phoenix ammunition. Make sure to check the uh, discount code down below to save some money. All right, let's see. Uh, how much flatter this thing shoot with more high pressure blow here. Here we go. Wow, that is crazy. Yeah, definitely, definitely doing this job. Keeping that rifle right on spot. Uh, let me shoot my steel target. I'll probably knock it down. But let's see how many rounds I put. Pretty decent uh, rate. All right, here we go. All right, here we go. Yeah, I knocked it down. <laughs> Woo, wow. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, buddy. That about boy is smoking now. Look at that thing. <laughs> yeah, she hot. Definitely. But it definitely is a flat shooter there. I mean, I have shot many other muscle devices, but I wanted to do this video as first impression, first time. Like I said, I haven't shot in round two till today. And yeah, I'm very impressed. I mean, there's all the many devices out there that do just good. But by far, this one, it, it, it's doing its job very well. Uh, the angle grip again, I wish it was a little more of an angle. They do have vertical grips. They do have pistol grips, uh, hand guards, all that good stuff. Uh, so hopefully in the future, we can build a whole fortress manufacturing rifle with some of the parts and everything. And I uh, definitely recommend that muscle device there. Uh, they have other ones as well. But I never tried this one here, so I'm really impressed of it. I mean... I know y'all tired of me here and say that, but that definitely put this rifle a much, whew, that's hot, <laughs> uh, 
definitely made this a uh, this rifle shoot a lot more flatter. That's for sure. Um, especially if you're doing competition, like I said, you definitely gonna um, have some great fast follow up with this muscle device. But yeah, so far so good. Ah, right, let's put another Mac two and then uh, finish this video. Stand by. All right, guys, so I got more French away ammunition loaded here. I wanted to try something here and uh, shoot it, fold it, see if uh, Willie can tell if the muscle muscle break does its job when I put him in my shoulder. So, all right, let's see. Whew, this bad boy is hot. All right, let me see if I can shoot a broad gloves. All right, here we go. Okay, lock that open. Uh, couldn't really get a hold of the front because it's, it's hot. But other than that, it keeps it well maintained. Uh, again, if you're not rapid firing, just taking single shots, uh, you can definitely go back in on target for sure. But uh, yeah, uh, yeah. What y'all think about this? Uh, what they call the red muscle device? Uh, from Fortis Ammunition. Again, I'm really impressed with how well it works and functions. Uh, definitely recommend it. Uh, as far as the the angle grip here, I mean, it does the job and everything. It's aluminum. It does, does feel a little warm because it's been rapid fire, but other than that, just doing, uh, you know, not too fast overshooting is definitely going to help. But other than that, I like it. Definitely like it. Recommend it. I uh, definitely will put this or any other built here. Um, but it does the job real well. I right, guess I appreciate Fortis, uh, Fortis Manufacturing <laughs> for sending the um, the red here. Muscle device brake. Uh, definitely does the job. I really recommend it. Do have it in the nitride black here. Uh, hard and eyes. And as well in the stainless steel. So if you want to go that route, if you have, you know, all stainless steel barrel. But it definitely, it's a much better improvement for this rifle here. Definitely keeps it flat. I mean, even though the A2 does the job, you know, this definitely will keep it. If you use it for comp competition, definitely will help you get those follow-up shots real fast and quickly. And keep that rifle, you know, flat while you're shooting. Alright guys, as usual, make sure to give this video a big like, thumbs up, um, you know, follow, share, like, subscribe, all that good stuff. Make sure to check all the playlists as well as uh, turn the notification bell on because a lot of people will not get notified of my videos. So make sure to check that if you subscribe or been a long subscriber, make sure that you turn it on to all so you know when things come up. Always posting videos, at least three to four videos a week, trying to, <clears throat> you know, bring some content out to you. Uh, it is a lot of work, so make sure to give this video a thumbs up. I really appreciate it. There is a thank you uh, button down here where you can donate whatever you like. You don't have to. Uh, it's not necessary, but make sure to go follow me on Instagram where you have a link tree in my bio where you can check out all the products, discount codes, and everything to different, different many other uh, products as well. And as usual, uh, make sure to, you know, like, share, subscribe. I don't think I said it already. <laughs> but anyways, I appreciate it. For this ammunition, and as usual, thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.